Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another Gore's Trailer Reaction and this is for a game I am so looking forward to. It comes out this Tuesday, Mafia Trace. I cannot wait. I love Mafia 2. I really did. I loved Mafia 2 and I, I loved the original. I was actually one of the few, I think, that actually played that game when it first came out and I really enjoyed that game. Uh, and Mafia 2 was great, I thought. Uh, Mafia 3 looks even better. Uh, and I haven't played a good open world GTA style game in quite a long time. I could have just said sandbox game, but I don't know. I just I, I didn't. I don't know why. But anyway, I'm excited for this. This is a I guess a European trailer. I don't know. But uh, this is about owning the battlefield, which I'm pretty sure this is the one that has the KKK members in it. There's been a controversy so far that you get to I guess shoot KKK members in this, which I don't know about you, but I'm excited. So anyway, let's check this out. Sorry for all my KKK fans. One of the pillars in the game from really early on was this notion of owning the battlefield. And a lot of that came from this idea that Lincoln's a Vietnam vet and he has special training and skills and tactical knowledge that a normal mobster wouldn't. And that really gives him the edge when he's going up against waves of uh, mobsters and his training allows him to overcome those odds. And we really tried to incorporate that into gameplay in a number of different ways. One, we support stalking in the game. So, you know, you can go through and you can stalk your enemies. You can put yourself in the right position to take down an enemy. We support a wide variety of weapons. So everything from classic uh, machine gun all the way to Vietnam era weapons, our version of some of the weapons that they were using over in Vietnam, handguns that you might expect a mobster to use all the way to more military feeling stuff. Lincoln also Whoa. gains the no, ability to put on a flak vest and he gains grenades and other things that uh, the mob initially at least doesn't have access to. We have a robust oh, cover no, system, you know, it's a open world game, but <laughs> we tried to make sure that there was cover kind of available there. everywhere and take cover behind cars and you can take cover behind pretty much anything in the this environment awesome. that looks like looks it like should be fun. cover. And then the way Lincoln moves through the environment, he's a little bit more nimble than mobsters. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. um, he's a little bit more effective at moving through combat. Um, and then finally, he's got not just his arsenal of, of ranged weapons, but he also has his fists and his knife, and one of my favorite parts of the game are the, the brutal takedowns that you can do on mobsters. You get them stunned or you catch them by surprise. Uh, and many times, if you pull one of those off, it will have kind of a ripple effect and the guys around will get stunned for a moment and that gives you an opening to take down another guy. So uh, we tried to give the player a number of tools to make that was feel brutal. like he really does own the battlefield. I, want, I guess this is the trailer that has the... Um... Or maybe so did, did I really blink and not miss it? Take I mean, down, I down. Not miss we'll it. have and if you pull it. prize mobsters are the the he all is moving through the environment. He's a little bit anything in the environment. Well, I know about the KKK stuff. Maybe we have I a robust it. cover it system. Might, it might have been just like a blinking via weapons. So myself in a number of different ways. One fist and might have stun. Well, I know it happens. So anyway, um, wow, that looks awesome. That looks really really fun. I, I, hey, look, it's me. <laughs> stupid ass thumbnail. I was just checking to see if this was like something that just came out. Um, yeah. Or I was watching like an old trailer. But yeah, no, that looks great. I, I like he owned the battlefield, but it, it's really just all the same shit. It's not like maybe maybe you can kind of do stealth kills and stuff like that throughout most of the level, maybe. But I think it's just gonna be straight up just mayhem. You just like, alright. I'm in good position to murder five of them at once. All right, bam, but it's going to be really loud and everybody's going to know you're there. Um, and I love the gunplay. It looks really, really fun. Uh, just the way he maneuvers and stuff. He said that in the video, like how he maneuvers is very much like a, someone that has been through war and stuff. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to this. This looks great. A good little <laughs> screenshot here. <laughs> he just gets stabbed right in the fucking head. Um, yeah. This game looks like a lot of fun, and I'm actually interested in the story and all that, but I'm really looking forward to, to this uh, just for the gameplay. <laughs> so anyway, there you go. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to give this a trailer. and I can't speak. I'm going to give this trailer, not give this a trailer. I'm going to give this trailer a 8.5. Good trailer. Good trailer. So there you go. Anyway, thank you. 